I want to see this. Because, I mean, it's technically accurate. I still remember thinking like Skies of Arcadia was supposed to be that uh, imagined, mm -hmm. finally. And nope. Different company. Oh, this is going to be oh so great. A haunted wine cellar. Ooh, that was close. 1881. Okay. Oh, awesome. We have a drunk Jinjo on our hands. Should I believe? Oh, here's some more notes. Oh, I didn't even realize this. We are really low on the note count. Yeah, this is a pretty big level. Okay. Well, we got a Jinjo. Boom, boom. There's also another stop and swap hidden in here. Is this one where one of the mystery eggs is? Yes. Yes, guys, even though I didn't play a banjo game, I'm aware of Stop and Swap. It was that big a deal back in the day. Well, that's all we can do in the cellar. That was kind of anticlimactic. We got a jiggy out of it, though. We did. Let's see, there are running shoes here somewhere. I don't know where they are. Oh, well, we'll do it. Oh, that's for voting. Uh, shack out in the middle of nowhere that's glowing. There's another puzzle. Greetings, oh solid one! I'm Tumblr the Mighty! Solve the, the puzzle and you can take this infernal thing that's stuck under me! So this is uh, another- So he's a talking shot glass. Yes. I did not. So oh, it's a Ouija board! Let me guess what you're going to spell out. Ow! Watch the grunty squares. Could you be spelling out Banjo-Kazooie? I don't know. Could I? I have no idea. Oh, stupid ghost. You can kill him with the feather, but... Somebody tells me he responds. I don't think he responds, but it's just not worth the time to try and chase him around with one feather. We need a K. We need a K. There we go. Hey, hey, hey! Well, one more K and we would have been racist. <laughs> oh, crap. Uh, well, now we're racist, Alex. Ghost, get out of my face! What did I just spell? I don't uh, know. A, so we need Z. Okay. Zoom K. Are we gonna this in time? I don't think so. We run into the ghost too many times later. Ah! And right, now we need another O. Yeah, I'm not gonna make this one. Okay, then can we just position ourselves really close to the B? Oh. No, because it takes us out. Ah. Wow, it put us all the way out here. I hate when they do this stuff. At least it didn't cost me a life, but I really do hate stupid things like that. It's like, just let me try again. Why do I need to go to the start all of a sudden? Oh, where are we now going back for it? I'll go back for it in a bit. Well, there's the running shoes, and I wonder where those were. And more eggs! Do we need more eggs? Can't hurt. Well, we don't need to let go fill the pots. No, we don't need to fill the pots. And oh, that actually makes me wonder how we're gonna get that Jinjo. Oh, I think that's going to pass out. Four Jinjos thus far, so that's already a, a Jiggy almost done. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, this looks like a church. And it's a so time it's trial! You can do it, Alex! Like a oh, no. camera, camera, camera! Camera is the main of your existence. Let's see, I just need to see the best path. Go! Big outdoor is very top! Stupid bear is not fast enough! Okay. I can already tell you that the Grunty is a good villain. Why? Because she taunts you all throughout the game. Mm -hmm. That's why there is a tremendous amount of satisfaction, I'll bet, when you beat her. 
Oh, for sure. Oh, for sure? I don't think I can. Let me try this. Now I can. I gotta ground pound it. Because you're already occupying Kazooie in the fact she's right. Well, I knew we can't ground pound with that. I keep going on the wrong way, that's yes, the problem. You do. I gotta go that way. This way! Where is to call when okay, I so she's gonna taunt you again? No. Oh. This one. So that's good, she's not annoying. If she was, I'd have to hurt her. And I wouldn't be clowning her. Oh my oh. god! Everything's last second in this game. Do you have any Christmas rare? I have am... kids a heart attack. <laughs> and we're out of gold feathers. I don't think we can take care of these guys. No, we will just have to work, manage. Oh no, a giant, is there not going to be like a music puzzle here? Yeah, but it's extremely easy. Okay, good. Music puzzles can have a really bad habit of being horribly hard. Oh, ow, get up there. So this is what the master hand from Smash Brothers does! Lord Sand plays his organ with these, but you can follow him on the keys. Seriously, that's the master hand from freaking Smash Brothers. His name is Mozart. Get it? Like Mozart. Mozart. Oh, 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 I see what you did there, Rare. Wow, talk about hand holding. <laughs> Not bad, Bear, but now watch me cop and copy this tune and amazed I'll be. Again, super easy. The turtle puzzle is harder. Yeah, no kidding. And being quiet so that Alex can concentrate you don't need to on come. the immense hand holding of this of this puzzle. <laughs> Quiet, I was trying to make a joke! <laughs> That's right, Mr. Peabody! Quiet, Chew. Quiet, Chew. Oh, what did he just push? Okay, I thought he pushed a note and I didn't see. But... Oh, this is hilarious. Now, come on, Alex, don't let this get out of hand! <laughs> I can keep this going, guys. Your music skills are mighty fine, so take this golden piece of mine. Yeah, that was pretty, pretty freaking easy, considering. Okay, so I'm assuming you jump on the music to get up to the pipes. Yep. Oh, there's notes in here, too! Of course there is, there's notes everywhere. At least we're halfway done. How did Disney not get on Rare's case about that sounding like Goofy? <laughs> yeah, that's what I want to know. Maybe that's why we haven't seen a decent Mancho game in a while. They're too busy paying off Nintendo. <laughs> or, paying off, or paying off Disney. No, Nintendo's too busy trying to pay off Rare for the Banjo property. To which, I I'm just going to ask honestly, if they were actually to acquire it, Alex, yes. would you feel like Nintendo shouldn't have it? No, I won't. Or, because you know that as soon as Nintendo gets it, it would go towards Retro Studios, because that's kind of their main third-party developer now. Yes. And so that wouldn't worry you? No, not really. I mean, the only, as long as they don't go the Donkey Kong route, which is make it ridiculously hard, which I've heard that... Do retro Donkey Kongs are, then I would never have a problem with it. I, I have no idea. I mean, we, we played Returns a little bit, but we didn't get that far in them, so it's hard to judge it. 
I have no problem with them getting the rare properties as long as they do right by them. Yeah. You know, I don't want to hear from rare fans that they have totally disgraced Banjo or whatever, even though you could technically make the claim Microsoft already did that. Yeah, I'm not sure you can disgrace it much more than Microsoft has. I think Microsoft kind of did that out of spite, because they thought they were going to get a real cash cow with Rare, and, and unfortunately all the Xbox games that Rare came out with, which who knows, we might actually have to do a few of them just to see if, you know, Rare really did fall as far from the tree as they might get out. Because I actually was considering, like, when I first got an Xbox, of playing Kameo Elements of Power. Mm -hmm. uh, and I didn't hear anything horribly bad about that game. But I just heard it, I heard it wasn't Rare's best. So trying to find the best way down. Wow, to... that, that honeycomb almost looked like a wizarding card from Harry Potter. <laughs> actually, I'm Collect gonna go them get... all. Why don't I go get that gold feather? Is there an actual way to kill those? What the gold feathers, guys? yeah. Uh, of course. We don't have enough to go around. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Ah, still did it too soon. But still, I didn't die, so. Exactly. Achievement. <laughs> no, get out of my street. Okay, well, he's dead. And we just earned our health back from the fall. Seriously, man, they are really trying hard on the Halloween theme here. Yes, it, this is Halloween. It just seems kind of corny to me, but that, that's just because I th this feels like a spoof world. I mean, it's rare, so they all yeah, have it's, that, it's rare. So they have that ton of cheap quality to it. Exactly. So I'm not saying it's bad. It's just it feels like a spoof world to me. So it's kind of hard to take it seriously. It's, it's like um. Nightmare Before Christmas in Kingdom Hearts feels very spoofy. Mm -hmm. uh, like, did, like Square Enix wanted to honor what Tim Burton did, but you know didn't really have all the authorization to do it. Oh, there's a honeycomb. Honeycomb hut. hut. Newest trademark of this series, Honeycomb Hut. Okay, that's. Uh, I told you I'd get you saying that. That does it for the church, though. All right, cool. So, where Dude. does that put us? We were like at almost sixty notes, and I think we're like halfway through with Jiggies. Let's see, fifty-six notes. Oh. oh. Four. Four. Yeah. So we're almost halfway. Yeah, this is a pretty big level, actually. And it's just very non-linear compared to the others. I mean, not that this game is particularly linear, What? But... A game went non-linear? It's almost like it's Castlevania 2. I can't even believe I just did a Simon's Quest reference. We have gotten requests to play that game, though. Of course we have. Oh, man. People just want us to feel pain. Why do you want us to feel pain, YouTube? Why? Some kind of masochists, are you? I think it's just more they want to be entertained. Of course. Ah! Why? There's one, though. But we're not going to do one right now. I don't know, we might have to do it like before October just so that we can trudge through the crap and then get to <laughs> get to a golden piece. This Castlevania 3 is actually kind of a redeeming game on the NES. Come on, I know, I can get up there. Oh, that will be interesting because I actually to this day have not beaten Castlevania 3. But then again, I don't know of a whole lot of people who have without a game genie. Mm -hmm. The game seems pretty hard. It's, it's not that the game is hard, oh. it's freaking Dracula that's the problem. It's like the first time when they did Dracula is kind of a four-phase encounter, and you know they didn't do it after that, because no Dracula encounter ever goes past four phase, or past two phases. 
Let's see. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Uh, other side. Oh, just a ghost. There it is. Oh. Oh, yeah. and oh. Jen. And that's the hard part. You can never quite see where the ghost is. Oh. Ow! Stupid Grotilda switch. Okay. Right there. Okay. Uh, on this wall. Okay. Z's on the other side. Z. He's gone. Okay. And this puts us at 60 notes. Woohoo! 60 notes. Quarter of the way there. We must get that Ikamboka, Malix. It taunts us. And by the way, I haven't mentioned you can't stand on these little things. They're like thorns. Yeah, I'm kind of noticing. You can as the pumpkin. Incomboke. Incomboke, and it looks like we can. Act oh, there it is. There's the mumble pot. Yeah. I'm just trying to make sure I've done everything else first. There's still a number of other stuff I need to do. There's yeah. some stuff I need to do. Indeed. Do you call that archaeology? I call it a bash. Get out. Uh, this is one of those doors we have to approach on the other side. Uh, yep. So you can bash the lock in. Get out of my face. I wonder if I can manage the high jump. It's going over. Yes! He's go. on fire! There we go. Boom shakalaka! Yes, I just did an NBA Jam reference. What you gonna do, YouTube? What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Uh, not watch G4. Oh wait, G4 doesn't exist anymore. Yep, doesn't. Makes me kind of sad. I mean, I, I do want like a, a gaming network, but well, the I, problem don't, is... I just don't want what they did. The problem is, gamers don't watch TV. No, really. Um, the most TV we watch is, like, Netflix. I think the perfect thing that actually encapsulated what, what gamers do is something that my brother left on my Facebook wall, which was the Dos Equis most important man in the world, mm -hmm. saying, I don't watch TV, but when I do, I watch an entire season of ne on Netflix for an hour, for six hours. <laughs> <laughs> Stop falling in the water, douchebag. The problem is, is that, like, where TV is interesting, there are way too many games we're trying to catch up on. At least that's my case right now. I'm playing way too many games that I can't watch too much TV. Or, heaven forbid, I'm in college, so... Yeah, it's not like I have a whole lot of time anyway. Where are we on, Jiggies? 62, uh, Jiggies, we have, like, five or six. Five. There's a few you get as the pumpkin. But I just... And I don't think we've gotten the ginger one yet. Because right. we haven't come across the yellow ginger. You keep running through the tall grass and I'm expecting you to get rubies, like from Zelda. <laughs> All right, let's uh, can just you go, go down the well? Yes, but I want to do that as the pumpkin. If I can, well, it seems uh, to if me I like... can just find Mumbo's hut now. It's... Uh, other way. Mm. All right. 
Oh, there's some notes on the church. Yeah. Can we get up there? Yeah, we can get up there. Ah, I gotta do that. Come on, get on the headstone. Narrow platforms. This is not a good idea for a 3D platformer. Oh, I know where another jiggy is. It's on the very top of the church. Is it a jinjo? I don't think there's a jinjo up there. But I know there's a jiggy up there. Hmm. Good thing there's not a jingo. We're I mean, totally looking for jingos, not jingos. <laughs> jingos. Did I say jingo? Yes, you did. <laughs> Inka Volcom! Hey, at least you didn't say something else. I mean, oh, crap. Crap. We could have easily had a moment uh, like Scrubs where. I can't remember her name. The, the one. I don't know. I don't watch the, the one show. female doctor who can't afford, uh, can't avoid saying non-curse things. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny to listen to the doing term that? she comes up with. Okay, let's see if we can actually get these notes this time. Without falling. That'd be that'd be preferable. Seventy-four. 75. We're literally grabbing them with our nose. Just follow your nose, Banjo! Where everything goes! I get it! It's a jiggy that you have to go to the top for! It's Banjo Kazooie Assassin's Creed Edition! <laughs> I got it. I actually thought I saw the Jinjo from up there, but maybe I saw the skeletons. Well, I saw the skeletons. Just the skeletons. I uh, hang a left right there. I think that's where Mumble Set is. Right here? No. Uh, go back into the churchyard and then go left. There you go. I can't get in there. Oh, okay. That's too narrow. Oh, there we go. See, I was right. Kinda. Yay! More mumbo! More notes. Is there uh, any on the top of the hut? There might be. It doesn't look like there's anything up here now. Never be too careful. Gold feather. Not bad. That's one more than we didn't that we had. Ah, you'll find big hidden features though. Mumbo turned Banjo into a T-Rex. Crush which easy! <laughs> this is an Easter egg. I've never gotten this before. Oh! I wanted to change T mind. T-Rex fell too good for this. Okay. Mumbo keep for next game. Well, yes, you do get the T-Rex oh, next day. Mumbo just officially trolled us! <laughs> I have never gotten that in all my playthroughs of this game, ever. Uh, Mumbo proud of pumpkin stuff. Make good soup. Uh, get away, get away now. He's hungry. We do not want to feed a hungry, hungry Mumbo. Hungry, hungry Mumbo. <laughs> I have never gotten that T-Rex Easter egg before, ever. It actually existed in the N64? Yes, it does. See, this, this is here to help Alex just as much as it is to help me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Because I've got... experienced this, this Easter egg, I don't need to experience it again. Because I, I mentioned before when we started that there's another Easter egg where he might turn you into a washing machine. Oh, wow. I'm starting to think uh, Mumbo kind of hates you with all the voodoo. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, why can't we get the Jimmy in there? I can't get up there. But there's you have to fall from the drain pipe to Gotcha. The... And actually I gotta find now that we're the pumpkin. Not the pumpkin king, but just the pumpkin. That's right! I am the pumpkin king! And I just can't wait until next Halloween! I don't know who clear it is. I knew a guy in high school who he knew the lyrics by heart without ever seeing the movie. Dude, uh, go watch, uh, or he knew it without see knowing the movie? Yeah. That's hilarious. 
because he had the soundtrack and he just listened to the hell out of the soundtrack, but he never had seen the movie. But he knew all the lyrics by so heart. nobody showed him the movie? I'm sure he saw it at some point in his life since then, but that was the case. Gosh. <laughs> Adam is so amazed he's leaving the room right now. Okay, just turned on the light. I was so amazed I had to go have my head explode off camera. 